Well, Northeast Indiana is going green thanks to a few companies and a farmer who wanted to help make renewable energy more accessible. Fox 55's Gentil Nil tells us more about a new solar panel structure. It's sunny and a little greener with these solar panel arrays off of County Road 70 and State Road 3. We had corn in here last fall. Dennis Sutton used to own this land and sold it for this solar panel generation station that will help power up about 120 homes a year. With the help of the power companies Wabash Valley Power and Noble REMC, there are 648 panels on six acres of land. I think it's a great project for everyone to get interested in. He's lived here all of his life, and this is the largest green project in the area. It helps Noble, LaGrange, Steuben, and DeKalb counties get renewable energy. You won't see a major difference in your bill, but it will help a little since it's dependent on part of the day. Uh, this project really is special in the fact that it's a community project that focuses on helping those in the community that can't do solar power on their own. The company that built the array says it helps in more ways than one. This is actually a dual purpose array, um, which is atypical of what we do. But all of this grass you see inside this array is pollinators for bees. So we'll be not only managing the solar power here, we'll be managing the actual pollinators and the wildflowers that are going to be growing. More arrays similar to this one will be going up in Missouri next. The project is operating in three states currently, Indiana, Illinois, and Missouri. In Noble County, Gentil Nil, Foss 55 News.